a pink, graceful bird. This is a flamingo, one of nature's most beautiful works of art, with its graceful demeanor and beautiful plumage. Flamingos live in aquatic ecosystems such as lakes, rivers, and marshy beaches in temperate regions of Africa, South America, Southern Europe, the Middle East, and Western India. Lake Nadrin, located in Tanzania, is one of the most famous flamingo habitats. Flamingos have a body length of between 2.1 meters and 1.3 meters and a weight of 3.5 kilograms, which is very light for their height. Unusually, their feathers have an elegant pink color despite their long legs and large wings. Flamingos rarely fly for long periods of time or travel long distances. They mostly prefer to rest by walking or standing. Flamingos have comb-like filters in their beaks that allow them to wade through mud or sand when searching for food in the water. Flamingos have webbed feet, which allow them to be active in the mud without the risk of falling in. Flamingos have a lifespan of 30 to 40 years, but in the wild they live for 15 to 20 years. Flamingos feed on plankton in the water, crustaceans like dogs and shrimp, and seaweeds like artemia and blue-green algae, as well as small fish. Artemia and blue-green algae contain a chemical called carotene, which is absorbed by the flamingo's body and applied to its feathers, giving them a pink glow. They mate once a year and lay a single egg in a depression in the mud that they build to suit their wetland habitat. After 30 days of incubation, the eggs hatch and the fledglings are cared for for five days before leaving the nest to live together in small colonies. But until they reach adulthood, they're still fed on their mother's milk. The flamingo's wet esophagus is called crop milk. It's an unusually bright red liquid, which is a common misconception about flamingos because it looks like milk or blood. They even have a habit of co-parenting, as this crop milk can be given to males as well as females. Their natural enemies include crocodiles, royal lizards, birds of prey, and mammals such as hyenas, baboons, and leopards that live in the marshes. They have no defense, so the only way to avoid them is to run away. Flamingos usually stand on one leg, and while this behavior is not fully understood, it is believed that they do this to reduce muscle fatigue and to protect their body temperature. Lake Natron, also known as the Lake of Death in Tanzania, is a volcanic lake filled with sodium bicarbonate that is home to a large population of flamingos. It is a lake of death for other animals who enter the lake and are burned or frozen to death. The lake is a key habitat for flamingos in Tanzania because it acts as a shield against natural enemies. Flamingos' long, slender legs are resistant to the corrosive water allowing them to survive in Lake Natron. So far, so pink and graceful, you've learned about flamingos. For more animal documentaries, subscribe to Alpaca World TV.
hippos are known to swim underwater. In reality, they sink as soon as they enter the water. Their bodies aren't very buoyant, so they're not very good swimmers. In the water, hippos propel themselves forward by holding onto the bottom. Then, they leap out of the water to the surface. Because of this aquatic lifestyle, hippos can't swim in water that's too deep or they will drown if the water is too deep or if there is no terrain to leap over. However, even though they are simply walking underwater, their speed exceeds the swimming speed of many animals. Their underwater jumps are so powerful that they can reach the surface in a single leap from the bottom of the water. So, even though they can't swim, hippos don't have any problems living underwater. They can hold their breath underwater for up to 5 minutes. When they exhale, they pop up to the surface and exhale water vapor through their nostrils. This is the same way whales make a stream of water at the surface. That was the first story about hippos, 